Are you considering water birth like me? If you are, there's so many things that goes into planning a water birth. Let's check it out! Hi Dr. Paul, nice to meet you! Nice to meet you! you. Understand that many women are planning to have a water birth but they have so many questions in mind. So first of all, is water birth safe? Water birth is very safe. I think the most important thing is to select the patients who are suitable for water birth. And for us, we choose patients at low risk pregnancies. So those who have complications in their pregnancy, and I say complications would be things like diabetes and pregnancy where the baby's going to be big, uh, where there's hypertension in pregnancy, multiple pregnancies like twins, uh, previous cesarean sections and trying for vaginal birth. We normally tell them not to attempt to do the uh, water birth. I heard many friends saying that water birth can actually reduce pain during the contraction period. Is it true? In fact, it's very effective. It's so effective that when the patient is, comes in very early labour, we actually tell them not to go into the water because it actually can wipe out the contractions and prolong the whole labour. So they go in only when they're in active phase and therefore when they're about 5 centimetres and above, then we allow them to go in. What is the right temperature of the water? Well, obviously it hasn't be too, got to be too cold. Uh, the best is actually body temperature. 37 degrees will be sharp. That'll be nice. And how long is the baby supposed to left in the water? We do it actually in a tub. And to describe this tub, it's more like a, a jacuzzi tub, but without the jacuzzi. And you're sitting inside there, the water is up to the level of your chest. And when you deliver the baby, the baby comes into the water and the head is probably in the water still. But to make it safer, because the risk, as most people say, is drowning of the baby, the baby swallows the water, breathes in the water. To minimize that possibility, we deliver the baby and get the mother to hold the baby's head up and by the time the body comes out, the head is above the water already. Unlike most women in Singapore, I have a friend who chose water birth instead of normal delivery. Guess who she is? Most of the women, they will actually choose natural birth, but they choose water birth. But why is it so? I think because I've seen a lot of positive reviews and comments about water birth online and I've read about it myself and I've watched videos and then you hear the process of it being a lot more of a relaxing a calming experience for the mother so I was very very keen to explore that and I think because I'm a water baby myself I love to swim, I love hot spas or hot springs and things like that I just thought it might be a much more comforting experience having that surround me and I also heard that it's also quite beneficial for the baby as well because the baby comes from water into water. So that's why I wanted to have that experience for myself. Okay, probably you can share with your experience like how is it like doing the whole water birth process? Do you recall? Um, I just recall going in and my husband was right with me. He was very supportive. He saw everything and I just felt it was just so nice to have this warm body of water envelope you while you are in this kind of distressed state, right? Um, I can't imagine actually doing that in dry air, as in like just lying out on the bed and doing it. I think I would feel a lot more pain. I think I would have probably torn a lot more. Um, I think it was, it was wonderful. It was just nice to be in there and it was great to have a support team on the side. My doula, my husband, the nurse cheering me on. And when my baby came out, it was like the most amazing experience just to feel him come out of the water. I cannot explain it, it's like, you feel so touched. Yeah, I was, I was, it was a more of a relief because you're like, okay, he's out, but it was just, it was sort of gentle in a certain sense as well and very comforting to have just that warmth around you while you're giving birth to your child. I think that's what's beautiful about it as well. That's great, fantastic experience. <laughs>